I'm at Lowe's and I came here because I was going to try to pick up a bottle of Wet and Forget because a lot of you guys are saying try Wet and Forget and see if that works for you. Um, you just spray it on and walk away and it comes clean. So I ended up spending about an hour in the store looking at all the different gimmicks that are on the shelves from outdoor Clorox, which is nothing more than bleach to all these different things they have, including one, I'm gonna show you the instructions say, drop the siphon tube in, apply it to whatever you're applying it to, let it dwell for three to five minutes, but don't let it dry, and then come back with high pressure and clean it off. And my question is, if you're gonna come back with high pressure, then why even put a chemical on in the first place? The pressure is going to clean it. Um, and they're like $20 for these bottles. My mind is blown that there's so many freaking gimmicks and people fall for it uh, compared to just going with my recipe. So it was kind of disappointing because I thought I was going to be able to do a good video today of like wet and forget versus surface cleaning. And there's, I'm not even going to waste my money. There's no way I'm going to waste my money and then wait six to 12 months for it to clean. Because that's what it says on the, I'll show you. Here's the wet and forget um, moss mold, mildew, and algae stain remover. Now it says no bleach, no rinsing, no scrubbing, no power washing, non acidic. First thing you turn around, you look at what the hell's that? And what does it say? Keep animals off treated surface until product has dried. If contamination occurs, rinse animals' paws. Uh, Plants, do not spray directly onto plants. Flush with fresh water if accidentally sprayed. Do not spray in windy conditions as this will reduce coverage and can increase spray drift onto plants. What the hell's in this shit? I don't, I don't understand. What's in this? I have no problems using bleach. Um, thin down to the recipes that I suggest. This is kind of scary. It was like 20 bucks for this. And you put a little pump sprayer on it. Or I guess you could pour this into like a backpack sprayer. Maybe spend 40 bucks and, and fill up a half a gallon of a backpack sprayer. And go ahead and um, spray something. And then it says, <laughs> this is the best part. It says, um, do not apply if rain expected within four to five hours. Well, there goes the south and be patient good things take time on some surfaces it can take six to twelve months for persistent stains to come clean six to twelve months i wouldn't use wet and forget if wet and forget gave this to me for free and said use wet and forget hell no I know what's in bleach, sodium hypochlorite, and I'll use bleach all day long. I'm sorry, wet and forget, but, and, uh, yeah, that, I'm not, no way, not going to happen. I'm really disappointed because I thought I was going to be able to do a cool, like, comparison of wet and forget with surface cleaning, but that's just not going to happen. Here's another one. This will blow your mind. Armorall Easy Deck Fence and Patio Wash. Kills mold and mildew. Eight dollars and ninety-eight cents. Sodium hypochlorite, five point two five percent. And as we've well established on my videos, sodium hypochlorite is bleach. So with this stuff, you hook up a garden hose, you spray it on, let it dwell, and turn the valve off or whatever, and then rinse. $8.98 bleach based formula renews the look of wood so deck fence and patio wash so when people say they will bleach hurt wood yeah but you got to be smart about it here's another one I was looking at this one kind of made me laugh too 30 seconds moss cleaner sodium hypochlorite bleach commercial grade 8% hook up your garden hose Spray it, rinse it. Tells you metal, plastic, painted surfaces, fiberglass, cloth, wood composite, concrete, masonry, tile. Let it dwell 15 minutes for concrete, 
wood and composite five minutes and metal plastic painted surfaces fiberglass and cloth three minutes so to all you people that like jump my crap saying how bleach is caustic and blah 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 and putting it on blah 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 I mean just write even this company 30 seconds cleaner.com I mean that they've got it recommended right in their directions and I'm sure their attorneys have made sure if you follow the, in, the instructions or if you do it like I do it rinse the damn shit off really good you'll be fine um, house deck and fence is what this, this is, is something that I would definitely I would consider I'd stand behind this and give this a shot I don't have a purpose for it right now um, I'm gonna do a driveway pressure wash video this morning it's actually gonna be a non talking just uh, we're just gonna go ahead and do my neighbor's driveway and uh, just let people see progress made just watch out for the gimmicks okay that's the point of this little quick video just watch out for the gimmicks man so much crap just follow my recipe it's it'll work